A no mask world, Kibra is one of the largest slums in East Africa. Within Nairobi County, it is an informal settlement where low-income earners live. We have camped our tents at Silanga village in Kibra constituency, where most of the residents here believe there is no coronavirus. Corona sa ili isha, corona hakuna. Ndiyo watu sababu wa mekata kufaa maski, corona hakuna. Yani pia tusipuze tusema ati sasa imeisha. Mm. Tunaza sema imeisha, na ndiyo sasa ikuja tle, kwa levo ingini le, na tukua tumetarajia. Our viewers, we are still walking within the locality of Silanga village in Kibra constituency, where we have been uh, going through, going around, to see whether people have been wearing their masks as per the guidelines of the government through the Ministry of Health. We are still located or still grounded here within the village of Silanga. Silanga village is within uh, Kibla constituency in Nairobi County. Uh, just uh, come with me and uh, see the, uh, how people are living the, the living lifestyle within this locality. It's still, uh, needs the government intervention. Most of them walking scot free without putting on their mask. <laughs> on the issue of corona, I actually and totally and up to now believe corona is there. Imam for corona. Some of them performing their daily duties and businesses without worrying about the spread of the virus. Maybe uh, we know I know and exist. It is a low rate because the fight is highly above the corona itself. We are fighting too much. Kwa mwoni yangu mimi nuna tu tuendele tu kufanya tu kuosha mkono, tuendele tu kufaa babara koa, eh, tufade tu historia serikali dunia wanasema. Jiuja tuneza kwa tunalenga na pengini yo kitu hiko. Mimi mm, na naamini corona hiko. Juu saa hii maisha ni magumu, kupata pesa, mikuwa shida, sasa hata tumekaa kwa milango, tumengojea corona hiishe, haishi. When the first coronavirus case was reported in March last year, the country went on a shock. As of the press and fellow Kenyans, I want to inform you that the Ministry of Health has confirmed the first coronavirus case in Kenya. Government officials through the Ministry of Health to fight against the COVID-19. But since then, here in Kibra, little has been done. Schools closed, uh, children are going out walking several kilometers looking for water and when they miss where to get the water they go to sewer lines to get the, the water and uh, having walked all that distance you find them taking the water direct, drinking it, taking it home for use and... Uh, what was most done where the cases were reported today is not there, keeping in mind that no social distancing, washing of hands, wearing of masks and sanitizing and sanitizing. Honestly speaking, Ms. Joy Fortilia is update the corona. Reason being, zilikuja zikakuwa like zimekuwa monotonous sana until the public does not know where the government is headed. Ju inafika time, the cases ni kama they are declining and then inafika time, zina shoot too all of a sudden. Ju Fortilia anga ju, ka ju zin liona, liona yon amba si me, si ju liko mefika 3, liko 370 something hapo. Na kuna time menyo liko nasikia ti imeriduce, yu mefika, imefika kitu. So, sa unajua 
kusikiliza aje story za corona manze hizo niliacha kufuatilia kitambo uko since place 2 fikitiwa na hiyo kitu ati akaenda hizo siji quarantine um, some of us which is part of me uh, we still continue the corona because put on our masks and the safe distancing mimi by the maintaining of our mask sana sana nikienda places places mob sana penye kuna wase alafu hiyo ku keep social distance unajua hatuwezi hatuwezi ignore tunaweza unajua kuna wasi wengine wanasema ati ni mboka lakini si mboka about wearing mask mimi social distance i do keep also ju i don't stay in one place i move around i can say it depends with the location and the place because hapa ghetto uniambi kuja kuosha mikono siju na kuvaa mask number one, being a person with a breathing problem mimi siwezi kuvaa mask for long so na vaa for some minutes na toa ama na vaa mask ile time na jua naenda tao i don't wash my hand regularly i, uh, I don't but i do when i'm, I'm eating i wash safe distancing i don't think so because also when you enter a bus nowadays they like also squeeze each other lakini mimi kuna bado naambiwa say ni kunawa au sanitize uvae mask na stay safe they just stay caution we never know we might think it may shock kumbe it's just a, an era we are about to start another one in some of these densely populated areas where the spread of the virus can increase in a supersonic speed hii corona ni kaa kuna cause watu wengi nasikia corona iko kibira na mimi sijaona mtu akapata corona so hakuna corona mimi ndo mimi najua corona ime rise i care cause ime affect watu wengi inaua watu ime inafanya like maisha ya watu nimerudi chini mimi najali kwa sababu kulikuwa na hopes ilikuwa inadai alafu tulikuwa turudi shule sasa mimi nimeanza ku rise tena Oops, I don't have any fear because I don't believe whether it exists. So reason being is that you find the in our area where we stay. So they don't believe the corona. The densely populated area of Kibra have got the challenges of scarcity of water. And the water here is not enough for the population, living by an example of the survivor of the fittest. Despite the government through the Ministry of Health issuing daily updates about COVID-19, some of the residents here says they no longer follow the updates. Most of the Kibla are reluctant when it comes to the following government directives. <laughs> kiangalia hata around huko kando kando uh, mostly watu wengi hawana mask na pia tujakuwa tukiona hizi cases mingi ya mtu amegonjeka au mtu ana corona ajeyo ana kitu camera desk ya kitu kaya so staff kaya tu tunaziona za tu kwa tv tu so um mimi ningeuliza miki mimi mwenyewe gavai fake ukifungia watu nafai acha tu watu wale vile kufanya kazi zao juu there's no point ya kushindwa kufungia mtu hapa na yet kinyo nafungia kuna sababu hakuna reason yoyote so mimi ningeuliza mimi ningesema gavai fungulia wase yache mambo mingi yeah. you don't you have a mask uh, you know people here they don't wear a mask all yeah and uh, according to the, the residents here yeah no use of mask no use of mask yeah according to your understanding uh, and, and, and to my observation as well <laughs> then <laughs> corona according to my opinion it exists at some point but it's being exaggerated in Kenya being put to place control the spread of the virus some of the residents here claims they have not had a close friend who have been affected by the covid-19 unashindwa hii ugonjwa ni ya watu specific ama inaitagonga watu wote kwa maoni yangu hakuna corona hakuna kitu kama hiyo hakuna kitu kama kama iko kwa nini wanaanza kufungua maduka mimi nilikuwa nataka kuwauliza mnasema corona iko kibira na sisi hatujapimwa hii corona walipima kina nani ndio walisema watu watu wako ngapi suji 18 mwingine alipita hapa anatangaza watu wamefika 18 kibira Huh? But the question that may be left behind is whether they have been affected. Bado tunafanya sisi ni nyama ngumu bwana. Hiyo hii nyama hii sio rahisi ile corona ingeje. Actually si yogopi corona jibali ijanifikia. Wanasemanga kidondo kuwa nayo 
kidogo naisikia kwa mimi hata naweza sema corona ni scam but kwenye mwenye mshikwa na corona actually ndo naweza sema kama ni ukweli ama ni wongo since most of the business and the jobs have been shut down by this ravaging pandemic of covid-19 that struck the whole world hizi masks za kuosha sasa hizi kwani kila siku mtu atakuwa na mga tu anaongangana na mask kuosha mask kuosha mask which is okay ndio lakini pia watu uchoka inafaa government chukue initiative ipatiane vitu za bure sila ile hata shilingi 50 ile naweza nikaenda nikanunua mask sasa kazi yangu ninajitanda na nini naweka hivi leso nikitoka nikitaka kwenda sokoni amba nikitaka kwenda dukani residents here in the streets of kibra are walking scot free around without wearing their mask for them hanging it on the chin it is a new norm during this covid-19 pandemic some residents believe it's through their hard skin which cannot be infected by covid-19 pandemic and others have decided that the mask is not a must <laughs> A poverty have in the slums is hitting hard among the locals who live below 200 Kenya shillings daily kabla ya hii shida hakuna mtu alikuwa analia mambo ya shida na chakula na nini hata kama we ni maskini ulikuwa na hustle at least unaingia kwa nyumba na kakitu sasa hivi tunarudi kwa msoto unaona sisi tulikuwa tu hustling unaona sasa hivi tunarudi chini kabisa na jasa watu wakubwa huko juu hawa nafurahia sana maisha na kesa sisi watu wa chini sasa in may last year president uhuru kenyatta put a dust to don curfew and, and sensation of movement of people to control the spread of the virus the lockdown which led to the closure of schools gatherings public meetings went on without success a move that never went well to kenyans and the government itself but only the interventions of the president saw the reopening of school fully in january this year the pandemic has left many without businesses and jobs Reporting for DBN TV, I'm Nelson Mushoki.